So in this video, I know I've done many videos before as to how we install ESXi, and only in the last couple of days uh, in my mini home lab series based on the AS Rock motherboard, we installed um, 8.0. 8.03d and i did say in that video that i get many requests asking me for where do i get the iso well now you can get the iso on the broadcom portal and what we're going to do in this video um i'm going to go right back to the beginning i'm going to pretend that i'm a newbie so i'm going to first of all register with broadcom so i can download that update download the iso um and then we're going to basically actually install that ISO um, and have a little look at if it's any different really to what is before. Now, I've already installed it early this morning. Um, one of the first things that I've actually basically noticed is that it comes with a baked in license. The baked in license can be removed, but you no longer have to register for a license and input it. Um, same caveats really with the SXI free can't be added to VMware vCenter server. You can't use Veeam backup and replication or any other third party backup products. So that's exactly the same. One of the differences is that now when you install it, um, it doesn't run without a license for 60 days in evaluation mode. Now it has an ESXi free license. So for those of you that have used ESXi free before, um, it's a bit like sort of kind of now you install it, the license is already there and you're in free mode as before you installed it, you're in evaluation mode for 60 days and then you would actually add the license and then it would actually convert you to ESXi free. So without further ado, I've got a coffee here 